Welcome back to Rum Shop where we pour, sip, and toss some things. My name is Samuel, and today we're going to talk about a comment on a video I did about shaving and how I avoid razor bumps. Now the comment was, or the question I, I should say is, does alcohol dress out your face? Now before I answer that question, I want you guys to hear me out completely before I said yes or no. Because that question ties into not only its purpose, but also the main reason why many people would say that's how they avoid razor bumps. I am one of those people. So again, does alcohol dress out your face? Yes, it does, and we need it to. That's what it's supposed to do. Obviously, if you get a burn, then that means there's a cut somewhere or some bruise, something like that, right? The drying out of your skin, we need that. Here's why. Putting rubbing alcohol on your face after you finish shaving, for one, it tightens the skin, which closes the pores. Now, remember when you're shaving, the beginning, if you remember my video, in the beginning, you use warm water. The reason for the warm water is to open up your pores. Now, I went into more detail in terms of like washing and you know cleaning out your pores, but that's not the purpose of this video. So, again, warm water. Now, that opens up the pores. At the end, you use cold water, which I stated, that closed the pores. Now, now comes the rubbing alcohol, and that basically seals off everything, dries the skin, tightens the skin, and prevents infections from going into your pores. But wait, there is something I want to add to that comment or ask you guys. That is, what do you do after you apply rubbing alcohol to your face? Please let me know down in the comments below. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Take care, guys.